もう不要ですけどさやか目を覚ましなさいあなたの化けよ<笑>さあ飛び降りて What's up, everybody? It's Cashflow Nexus, your favorite chart analyst, giving you the latest and greatest updates on the charts. And today we're going to be looking at Casino Coin, a、uh, coin that everybody's been requesting. I finally found a chart for it, so I'm going to analyze it for you guys. But before I go that, I'm going to go through today's list, which will be starting off with some scripture, then going to the subscriber shout out, and then we'll get on these charts. All right. So, if you are new to this channel and you like what you see, feel free to subscribe and comment and give your thoughts on what you think. And welcome to my channel. So, today's scripture, I don't want to talk too much, but I want you to just marinate on it and just have think about what I said in this. I'm not going to get deep with this, I'm just going to get straight to the point. Proverbs chapter 23, verse 23 Buy the truth and sell it not. Also, wisdom and instruction and understanding. So, this is something I want you guys to meditate on, study it, and you know, get us,、uh, study thyself approved, get an understanding for yourself on what it means, and let me know what you think about that scripture in the comment section. All right. And here we go.、Uh, subscriber shout out. Today, I'm going to be shouting out. Let's see who we got. Kevin the Speedster. So, you said something that is very, very、uh, truthful that everybody needs to hear. You said, and I, 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 I pay attention to what's said in my comments and I look at what people say. So,、uh, this you know, hit home.、Uh, he said, God is good regardless of what happens with the cryptocurrency price. Remember to be grateful to God when the financial blessings come. All right, you guys, that's, I can't say any better than that. <laughs> no matter what happens with these prices, be grateful. So I, I'm going to just say he did, said, said it perfectly. I'm not even going to add on to it. What was said need, needed to be said because we are living in times where greed is a thing. And、uh, I believe that people look at money versus people. All right, that being said, let's jump into this analysis. I'm going to give it straight to you.、Uh, looking at these charts, what I see、uh, Casino Coin is doing pretty well versus you know, what's currently going on in the market. It did you know, drop from $0.09 cents to $0.06, cents, but it, it's recovering a little bit with the ink off a candle.、Um, but what I do see right now is that price is trying to. Make its way up, it's still above the cloud, so it's still bullish as long as it's above the cloud. What I don't like is how this is flat right here. k e j i n s e n is flat. We want some angulation in this market. It, when you get some angulation like this, that's saying that the market is, is going to move in a, a trend.、Uh, when k e j i n s e n is flat, it shows that market is you know, not. It doesn't have any momentum and that it's slowing down. And that's what I see right now in this coin.、Uh, but I did see this on the four hour time frame, which is what I like. Let me go ahead and show you this. So, right here, Kijin Sin is far away from price right here, which price wants to act as a magnet. So, what we might get is a pullback to the upside and continue that uptrend. So that's what I have so far, which is why I boxed this in. And it looks like that's what it's doing right now.、Uh, let's look at it even more. I do like this as well because right here we're seeing signs that、uh, the, bear, the bearish、uh, cloud is starting to form, get thinner right in this area. So we might get a TK,、uh, not a TK, a Kumo twist, like, just like here, but it's going to start forming purple. To the upside, so that's what I like to see. Chiku Span is above price right here, so that's a good sign.、Uh, Kijin Sen is flat right here, but then you see that it angled off, so that's showing momentum is in the, it's coming into this market. And then you see that it broke out of this box, so I expect price to get back to this blue line. And once it gets to this blue line, that's what I'm looking for. We could get a 
in wave you know pattern or formation like this i need to make this thicker so you guys see this yeah i see it right there so we could get something like this move up to the upside and then some downward momentum like this or what we could go, do here is get just a correction a minor correction and get a end wave in this formation here right there and back to the upside so we could get something like that so that's what i'm expecting in the market uh it, nothing too crazy i want to keep it realistic what i i'm predicting right now i'm gonna i'm going to say this is bullish i'm gonna say we're going to get at least back up to the seven uh cents seven cent and fifty right here if we break past this i i believe that we could easily reach back up to eight cents and fifty seven and if we get past this, which will be the B level from the N wave, so A, B, C, and then D, we could get back past this D level. So I'm going to draw a red line here. We could get past this level. And then I'm gonna say we could easily touch nine cents and above. So that's what I see in this market. I'm, not, I'm just keeping it realistic. I don't wanna say exaggerated prices because I'm not exaggerated. Uh, chart analyst so that's what i see in this market it looks pretty good to me i do see some bullish movement especially since uh bitcoin is falling to the downside uh currently yeah i see this currency moving up to the upside so it's doing the opposite of what bitcoin's doing so that's a good sign for this particular investment if you are invested in this uh cryptocurrency or coin or whatever you want to call it all right. That being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this technical analysis. God bless you guys and stay tuned for the next. All right. Peace. Yeah.